Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Tutorials by Nitin. I really hope that you all are doing well. In today's tutorial, I will teach you how to create before and after animation in Photoshop and also I will teach you how to create this animation in After Effect. So without wasting much time, let's jump into the tutorial. Here we have after and before images. Here is before, here is after. Now we have to create timeline in this. Sorry, we have to first we have create this animation in Photoshop. Go to window and turn on the timeline here is our timeline and see first if we hide this after layer and here in timeline it show before layer if we unhide the layer it show our top layer that is after layer so click and drag the this plus icon to duplicate this now select second frame in the timeline and hide the after layer we are just swap the layer uh, frames first is before second is after now here we can set the seconds of animation suppose I am set it to 2.0 means 2 seconds and here is 2.0 now just play the animation here is before here is the after here is the before here is the after this is a simple animation now if you render this click on these hamburger menu and uh, we have to export this go to file export save for web legacy zoom out the animation and once play here is before here is after here is before here is after uh, so here we can select looping options to forever and select here the format gif and adaptive transparency no transparency and last is save We have to save here. Now click on save and it will save. Now check what is this we have done. Here is before and after GIF. Open this in browser. Here is before, here is after. Here is before, here is after. Okay. Now open After Effects. I am using the version 2019. Here first we have to create the composition. Create a new composition. Width should be 1920 and height should be 1080 and make sure your both photos after and before should be this resolution here we can set the duration of our video i am set it to 5 seconds and frames is 30 is okay 
it okay now first here is our composition now first select the shape tool and create a rectangle like this okay now second step is select the shape layer and press p p for position we have to animate this position towards right so click on this keyframe icon here is our keyframe the dot is indicates our keyframe is set to this position now forward the timeline to 3 second and select move tool move the rectangle by pressing shift towards right now let's see the animation okay now uh, duplicate the layer 1 by pressing control d here we have to change fill click on this fill written text and you have to show fill options and click on none hit okay now on second layer we have no color and stroke should be around 20 pixel now see here is this stroke which indicates our animation line before after animation line now drag the both before and after photos to our composition first drag the before layer second drag the after layer before this we have to rename this so we are not confused regarding this shapes uh, this is fill layer and this is our line layer now select the before layer mm -hmm. select the before layer and here we have to change the our matte option select none and select alpha matte fill layer now just see the effect let's play the animation here is after and before animation that's all now if you render this go to file export add to render queue and here we can set the our uh, select the format avi uh, photoshop sequence quick time so for video you have to do this quick time select the quick time format and hit okay one is this and second is go to file export and add to adobe media encoder adobe media encoder is a rendering software you have to install separately like this i am doing to rendering this adobe media encoder this will export your video as a mp4 format in high quality so this will helps us uh, lots of time to convert the formats like if we render indirectly this so we have a 
dot mob file and mob file is highly increased sizable file so here is our adobe media encoder and here is our file and just click on play this will see this will file output is composition 1 dot mp4 so you can use mp4 format in anywhere here is our ending complete click on this output file link and see the output this is before and after animation I really hope that you guys have enjoyed my today's tutorial. Please hit the like button and subscribe if you have not yet subscribed yet. Thank you for watching. Bye, stay home, stay safe.